Hey guys, this is Trey, back with another video, and today I'm going to be getting rid of my guppies. And I just have way too many of them. They bred like crazy, and I just don't have the tank room for them. So now I'll talk to you more about them. So here was my guppy breeding setup, and I have the parents separated right now. But you can see there are just so many guppies in here. There's probably like 40 in here. So it's crazy how many. So I'm going to be keeping about five, maybe a little bit more, because there's some really pretty ones in here that I've never seen before. Like, I've never seen that type. So I'm also going to be bringing the rest of them. I'm going to fill up this bucket and bring them. And I'm going to be bringing them to a local fish store called Ocean Gallery. And this is a really good fish store. And they said they will take them because I just have way too many. So the ones that I'm going to keep, like that rainbow-tailed one, that one's really cool. And I'm going to be putting them in this guppy breeder box so I know which one I'm keeping. And then the rest of them, I'm just going to scoop out and put them in this five-gallon bucket. So in this bucket, you can see I have an aerator hooked up to it because I don't want anything to happen to them. So there's just a stone, and when it's filled up with water, it'll go in. And the bucket is stained this color. This isn't actually a really dirty bucket, bucket, and I've used it for plenty of tanks, and it's fine. It's just stained that color. But now I'm going to go ahead and keep some of them or get some and show, put them in the breeder box. Okay, so the tank should be all empty. And if there is like a baby or two in here, that's fine. But in here, I kept about eight to nine of these guys. And these, I felt like they were the prettiest and they were the coolest to me. So I kept those guys. And you can see all of the little babies and big ones in here. There are like that one right there. That is a or those two actually are big, big pregnant moms. So you can see there's a lot of fish in this bucket and it's crazy. So now I'm going to go hook up the aerator and I'm going to drive these to the store and I'll see you at the store. All right, so we're about to be at the store and you can see I have my aerator set up with a plug right here in the car. And then I just have the fish in here. They're all doing good. I just checked on them a couple minutes ago and you can see the aerators in there and they were all doing good, so I'll show you inside the store. So I'm back from the fish store, and I couldn't film inside of it because there were just a lot of people there, and they had two workers, and they were just very busy. So I left the bucket, and I saw him. He dumped it into a little container, and then he dumped them into the tank, which is perfect. He didn't complain at all, so shout out to them at Ocean Gallery, and they were just so nice about it, and I'll show you these guppies eating now. So again, like I just said, the people at Ocean Gallery are so nice, and I talked to them, and I'm going to be getting a Polar Convict, so make sure you subscribe and stay tuned to see what that is, and just see me get it, because it's going to be so cool, and also, I'm going to be getting a Mystery Fish for that tank, so make sure you subscribe so you can see what goes in there. So now, you can see these are the guppies that I kept, there's one down there, there's one over there and that's actually an endler my friend gave me so don't worry if you're watching this i didn't give it away i kept it and then the really pretty rainbow tail ones are in there that's another there's one of the rainbow tails you can see that one has like a black outlining it's crazy their colors and that one's like a metallic guppy so it's crazy how colorful they are and they're doing good in here so now i'm gonna go ahead the food that i got or I'm feeding them, it's just tetra flakes that I smushed up so it's small and easy for them to eat. There's another one back there. But I just throw a little bit in. Because, you know, there's six or seven fish in there. There's that metallic looking one. But my favorite are the rainbow tail ones. And they're the, to me, they're the coolest because... They have a rainbow tail, and one of them is outlined in black. So it's rainbow with an outline of black, which is really cool. But that's going to be it for the video. Thank you for watching, and please subscribe.